Hello everyone, this is Don't Believe Mustak, and today we are here with another main association of math leaks problem from January 2014. Meet 4, round 1, arithmetic with little equations, problem 3. Consider an interesting 5 digit number A. If 1 is placed at the end of A to make a 6 digit number, then it is 3 times the number made by placing 1 in front of A to make a 6 digit number. Find A. So this problem is kind of interesting because it's a word problem in the middle of this ground that's mostly just equations. Okay, let me see. It's mostly just equations. There's a few word problems, and I think this was the most interesting word problem there is in here. So, from this word problem, we need to make an equation. So, we need to basically follow the directions that they tell us in this problem. First, we need to make a number such that 1 is placed at the end of A. So when we place a 1 at the end of the number, that's like moving the whole number 1 place to the right, which is like multiplying by 10, and then you add a 1 in the 1's place. So you get 10a plus 1. So 10a plus 1 is the number you get when you add 1 to the end of a. Now, when you add 1 to the beginning of a 5-digit number, that means you're adding a 1, and then 5 zeros at the end. So if you have... 22,222, and then you add a 1 to the beginning of that, that's 122,222. So you added 100,000. So that's what we're doing each time with a 5-digit number. Whenever we add a number, whenever we add a 1 at the beginning of a 5-digit number, we're just adding 100,000. So this problem tells us that the former is 3 times the latter. Okay? So it's 10a plus 1 equals 3 times a plus 100,000. Distribute the 3. 10a plus 1 equals 3a plus 300,000. Subtract both sides by 1, so you get 299,999. And subtract both sides by 3a, so you get 7a. Divide both sides by 7, and you can do this using long division, or whatever method you want. And you get 42,857. And if you take 42,857, and then you add a 1 at the end, and then you add a 1 at the beginning, and multiply it by 3, you'll see that you get the same number. 142,857 times 3 is the same as 428,571. So it works out. And yeah. So This ground, I think, is a relatively easy ground if you know equations, know... If you just, it's mostly just plug and chug. I thought this was, if you want another equation to do, but that's a whole equation, I would suggest doing this equation. And I would also suggest doing this equation because it has logarithms in it. So, January 2013, problem 3, and January 2012, problem 3. I suggest doing those on your own if you want a more interesting equation problem. But for the most part, I think that this round is pretty easy. So I just wanted to show you this interesting world problem. And yeah, I hope you like this problem, and have fun doing math.